Emily Hayes from Keller Williams South Valley Realty and Emily Hayes Homes. And I wanted to wish everybody a happy, happy May. I hope everyone is doing fabulous. Um, today I wanted to just give you a few quick tips about buying into an HOA or selling from an HOA. So an HOA is a homeowners association and I know they get a bad rap, but they're really not that bad and depending on which one you have or every community is a little bit different. But when you are a buyer buying into an HOA community, it's really important to look for a few things that I don't think everybody always thinks about. And the biggest one is the financials. So you are legally required or the seller is legally required to give the financial documents. So the budget, the minutes, all that kind of stuff, but really the budget. So when you look at the budget, look at the reserves and see what the reserves are. And then we can find out for you, like if the roofs need to be done, what kinds of big expenses are going to be coming your way to know if they're going to have to do a special assessment. And a special assessment would mean, you know, assessing everyone, every homeowner, maybe like a hundred dollars a month for a year to build up that reserve money to pay for a certain project. So that's really important to know because HOA fees can go up and down, um, but special assessments are needed um, when big repairs are needed in an HOA community. Now, those documents, they need to be ready to go within typically two to four days after you go under contract. So I always recommend my sellers talk to their HOA and find out, you know, get all the documents together beforehand, including filling out your seller's disclosure forms before you even put the house on the market. That way, as soon as you get that offer in hand, you can send those docs over. Not only does it make you look on your game, um, but it also helps because it, it allows you to clear up any issues or questions um, that someone might have right off the bat um, due to the HOA or the disclosures. So, that is my advice today. If you know anyone who's thinking about buying or selling into an HOA, um, please let me know. I would love to be there to guide them through the process. And of course, if you know anyone buying or selling real estate, you want to make sure your friends up end up with a great agents that care. And me and Todd um, and Emily Hayes Homes, we really care about you guys and we want to help. So just let us know what we can do for you and we'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.